have seen Kate working with Violet. She's been doing different training with Violet. She's been really calm and chill, but bath time is something she does not love. Before we get into the video, go ahead and click the subscribe button and hit the bell to select all so you don't miss any of our videos. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and tell your friends and family about us too. It's the only way we can grow and that YouTube knows you're enjoying our videos. Be sure to follow us on Instagram and TikTok as well for extra content and behind the scenes footage. Let's get into the video. Can you not eat the bucket? So she's not tied, she's just... It's just wrapped. Wrapped, so if she does pull back. So she's not bathed her with a sponge yet. She's yeah. just hosed, hosed her before, her but she's... Good girl. Beautiful. water all down her shoe. So what I've learned is that normally getting them at the shoulder is actually better than getting like their legs or something. Oh, that drips right down my shoe. And then the other thing is, if you just like spray it, it's like moving. attachments so that she can kind of mimic what a curry comb would do because she actually loves being brushed and so that she's not just feeling like a high pressure hose. <laughs> so we just we just picked this hose attachment up at a garage sale and it can bend so that Kate can do it as if it's just a curry comb and she can adjust the pressure so that it's not just a hard stream of water. Let us smell this. So because Kate's been working on the other things with her, she's actually doing a lot better with this than she did before. And again, it's all just building up that trust. And then also just adjusting some of the things you're doing. So she wasn't loving it before with the one sprayer we were using. I wasn't even using the attachment. Oh, just with the hose and like, with yeah. your thumb to like make it spray. But it's the same Yeah. loves to lie and poop and get herself really dirty. Flora stays pretty nice and clean, but <laughs> Her baby didn't Violet know. loves to get as dirty as possible. She, she, she takes like, after Duke. She uses her, she uses poo as a pillow. If her stove is clean, she will poo and then lay down. Yeah, she does love to lie in poo. She'll like seek it out. She'll have the whole paddock to lie down in and she likes to go where all the horses, our horses tend to go to the bathroom in the same little spot because in the field. Foxy. Foxy was a very clean horse and so she would only ever poop in the same few places. And then we only had her and Kyla for a few months. So she taught Ky Kyla Yeah, that. she taught Kyla and then- And then it was then... just her and 
Kyla, and so when we brought Duke, Duke learned how to do that. And then Jack learned, and then yeah, they've all also a pretty clean horse, so she did it too. They've all slowly and learned. learned from her mom and her friend. <laughs> These two have learned. It's like a rite of passage. You don't know the booth corner, you're not allowed in their field. Or yeah, and so Foxy's not even here anymore. No, and so Vi Violet will literally go to that area, and she likes to like lie down and sleep there. I'm gonna have to give her a bath. I can't believe how good she's being. I mean, I can't believe it, but. I know. <laughs> she's. I was gonna say, well. She's really good. You kind of knew the outcome. For Stevie, if Stevie's doing that, like, kind of going back and forth, I'll tell her to stand and kind of get her in trouble for it a little bit and, like, not let her pace. But because Violet used to literally run in circles, it's completely okay for now for yeah. her to be kind of wandering back and forth because she's still a baby. Yeah, when we first got her, they weren't handled, they weren't used to being handled all the time because her previous owner, they loved them dearly and they took very good care of them, but they were dealing with some medical issues. So they weren't able to handle them as much as they liked. And so they just weren't used to a lot of handling so she's really and come. they were boarded so it was yeah and they were boarded so they've come such a long way now flora was used to it because she's at a trail yeah the, the previous owner only owned them for i think a year or two i can't remember they got flora when she was pregnant and then yeah so i think it was about a year that they owned and then the horses and then they had unfortunately medical issues that came they up. They were planning on having them as their first horses. Yeah, they were supposed like to be supposed forever to be horses. Her, like her kids' future horses. Yeah. Future horses. It but things obviously changed. tore them apart to have to let them go. They loved them dearly and you can tell how much they were loved because they are just the sweetest horses and they were very well cared for. But they just, they weren't worked with as as much because they, they just couldn't. And so Violet, for being just a year right now, is really remarkable. 